Hey guys, Samara here, back with the A-Team. This is my friend Sam. He heard all about New York Cares Day and was really excited about volunteering. So, you've heard all about prepping a paint station, now we're going to talk about actually painting. There's a lot of steps, so you guys really have to pay attention. I'm going to shoot you to Leah for the first step. Hi! The first step to painting your room is you want to paint along the trim. This is going to make it much easier for you when you decide to take out the rollers. Rollers are more for big spaces, whereas you want to use the smaller paintbrushes and the smaller paint cans to paint along the trim. So, all you have to do is simply dip your paintbrush in the small cup, wipe along the edges so you don't drip paint, and paint right along the trim. It's okay if you get paint on the tape because that's why it's there. No paint will actually end up underneath the tape. Paint all along the trim, and that's all you gotta do. Now to Samara for how to roll. Hey guys, so Leah showed you what to do with the brush around the trim. I'm going to show you how to use the paint roller. As you can see in the paint pan, most of the paint is towards the bottom. When you put your roller in the pan, you want to move it in a downward direction to make sure you get the entire roller covered with paint. But you want to make sure that there's not too much paint on your roller or you'll get it everywhere, which defeats the purpose. So, when you put the roller on the wall, you want to make sure to go upwards at first in zigzags making sure to cover as much space as possible. When you do a second dip into the paint pan, you want to go in opposite zigzags, covering the space that you missed the first time. As you can see, you can already tell the difference in color. Now, you see all the extra paint we have and a lot of gaps. So you want to go up and down to make sure to cover as much space as you can. Filling in the color so there's no discrepancy between the old paint and the new paint. When using a roller, you want to make sure to avoid the trim, the corners, and all appliances, which you can cover with a small brush. Now that you've learned how to paint and you've learned how to prep, tune in to learn how to clean up. Thanks, guys!